drinking coffee. Chocolate milk. No, really. You haven't had coffee till you had cold brew and chocolate milk. That's pretty good. So it is almost New Year's. Come below your New Year's resolution. A lot of people, they're gonna do some crazy stuff. Like me. It's like a half of a sphere. No, this cannot be real. Double stuffed Oreos are actually only one point. Same thing I do every night. If you want to do some crazy stuff during New Year's, you're trying to get lit. I want you to be safe and be responsible. And please don't do any of this stuff. Dude, you were so drunk last night. Why? What did I do? You took some matches, lit some random woman's hair, and started singing, This girl is on fire! I can't sing. Don't, don't do that. I wonder, would you go to jail for that? You set some girl's hair on fire? Like, you just took a lighter, like, <laughs> she got some greasy hair. Ooh, that fire gonna spread her whole head is gonna be burned off. No, man, that's not good. That's not good! <laughs> that girl is on fire! If you're doing this stupid shit, you need parental supervision. You need a friend to come with you and watch you and make sure you don't do anything stupid. Dude, what happened last night? I think I broke my arm and my car is wrecked. You were so drunk last night. What'd I do? You climbed on top of your garage and started yelling, na 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 Batman! Batman! I jumped off and landed on your car. And you didn't take me to the hospital? I was too busy laughing at you, dumbass. <laughs> yeah, I would too. I mean, he's obviously fine. He's Batman. Sis, thanks for taking care of me last night. You were crazy. Never seen you like that. I had to take your shirt off for you because you threw up on yourself. Then you made me read you a bedtime story. And then I f***ed you in. You better love me. Uh, whoa. Um, let's delete this message. Why? Just reread. Tucked. I'm a tucked you in. She'll never know. Hey, Dave. Don't talk to me. Why? What did I do? Last night you were so drunk you got my iPad and put it in a blender. Really? Yeah, you said you were making apple juice. But um. Ashley, I am not a culinary expert, but I'm pretty sure you made the wrong apple juice. That's more of like a apple smoothie. Last night I was so drunk I replied to my own text. Did you get home safe? Yes, I'm home now. <laughs> Dude, you have to stop drinking. You were so drunk last night at my party. No, I wasn't. What do you mean? You threw my hamster out the window saying, Pikachu, I choose you. <laughs> Wait, so did the hamster die? Unless the hamster was wearing like a whole suit of armor or he was in his like running bubble or if he was in like his running bubble, he would have died. He would have been roadkill. Or maybe he ran away. And then he became roadkill. I don't know, man. Has anybody done a YouTube video about this? Hamster thrown out of a window? Wait, is this the guy? Freddy's gonna die! Don't do it! Don't do it! No way! No way! No way! These kids aren't old enough to drink! Is this... The video stopped before they did anything. I like how they're playing this stupid-ass song in the background. <laughs> Who makes a video like this? I mean, they didn't even say Pikachu, I choose you. It's just, here's a hamster. Wait, do they have like yellow hamsters? Okay, I mean, close enough. What happened last night? You were drunk. No, I wasn't. You were cutting open all my pineapples yelling, SpongeBob, I know you're in there. You know you're a drunk when you were like, no, I wasn't. If other people are telling you, you were so drunk last night. You were probably so drunk last night. Cutting open all my pineapples. The fuck were you got so much pineapples for? Wait, what if you cut open a pineapple and there was Spongebob in it? Technically, it's possible. He's got to be in one of the pineapples. And he came over to your house like, Oh, what's this dude got so many pineapples for? Ooh, Spongebob got to be in one of them. I want to know if he found him or not. Dude, I got a DUI. I was arrested last night. I know, buddy. I was there. What happened? You kept insisting you weren't drunk. Then you asked the cop if you could use his in-car computer to update your Facebook. <laughs> no way you're getting out of the DUI. <laughs> okay, so you're going to jail. Hey, man, I'm going to jail. Wait, wait, wait. I'll oh, bro, dude, that's so cool. Hey, hey, you got you got a computer in there? No, nah, get in the back of the car. You're going to jail. Hey, man, can I, can I just log into Facebook real quick? Like, I, I got to update my status. Like, I'm 
getting arrested. This is a big deal. I'm gonna get like five likes on this. Good luck getting out of a DUI. It's not gonna happen. Guys, if you're watching this, please don't drink and drive. Some dude was drinking and driving. He hit my car, he went to jail, and he had to pay a lot of money. It's like, mm, take an Uber for 20 bucks, or get a DUI, and you're gonna be paying more than 10 grand. Like, you got court fees, you got lawyer fees, you got jail time, you got damages, it's... It's not worth it! Or you don't got money for an Uber, just keep drinking water until you sober up. It's, it's not hard. Dude, you were so drunk last night. No, I wasn't! Yes, you were! A guy robbed your house and took your TV. So, you ran after him and said you forgot the remote. <sighs> oh my god. So, I, wait, my TV is missing? <gasps> How could you be that drunk? Yeah, man, someone's stealing my shit. Oh, wait, you forgot the remote. Come back here. I'm just trying to help you out. Can't imagine being that drunk. Like, you don't even know your own house. You don't even know your own TV. You don't know your own remote. <gasps> Oops, I didn't mean to send that. I'm drunk. Send me another and I won't show anybody. This scumbag right here, I mean, first of all, she probably said it on purpose. Like, oops, I'm drunk. Blame it on the water. So when I was myself in bed last night, I was thinking how thankful I am for you. What? Tucking, tucking, oh my hell. My phone is gross. I phone correct fail. I'm so sorry. Oh, that awkward moment. This is a dude that you friend zoned, and then you send him this message, get his hopes up, and you're gonna be like, tucking, tucking, oh, I meant tucking. Definitely wasn't f***ing myself in bed last night. Kill me now. This is just so terrible, no matter who you send it to. Dude, you were so drunk last night. What? Was not. You picked up my little sister and shook her saying, Dora, how did you get out of the TV? What's so bad about that? She's Mexican, right? We're Irish, but after that you duct tape her to our flat screen and said, that's better. <laughs> I mean, at least you didn't go to jail. Where are you? Drunk, where are you? How are you drunk? I drank the goose water! It tasted like fire! OMG, that was vodka. I can't stop going to the bathroom! Did you throw up? Yes, it tasted like fire too. Am I a dragon? No, just stay put. Fear the great dragon, mortal. You're not a dragon. Burninator. Stop throwing up. Wait, dog? These texts are f from your dog? Or are you texting your dog? I'm so confused. Dude, you're so drunk last night. No, I wasn't. You tried to paint my dog blue and shouted, Do you see a clue? While pointing to a blue stain on the carpet. Actually, I was sober. I remember that vividly. I need new friends. <laughs> Just threw up on a dog, broke microwave with cheese and spoon, having a bath with my Barbies singing Final Countdown. Before you ask, yes, I found the absinthe under your bed. It's the best! <clears throat> Did you and Aaron eat me out? Eat you out? Rat. <laughs> Rat. Hey, sorry I fell asleep in you last night. Um, you fell asleep on me, not in me. Oh my god. There's a difference. Dude, how drunk was I last night? Well, at one point I convinced you to try and bite your own nose. Then what happened? You were rolling on the floor for an hour screaming, it's getting away! I hate you more than words can express. Yo, that'd be, that'd be weird. Imagine like biting your nose. You can't do it. Ask somebody to try to bite their nose. Uh, it doesn't work. It's impossible. In a state of frustration, will she ever bite her own nose? It's making me angry. Ha ah, ha, you were so drunk last night. What? No, I wasn't. Dude, you ran up to this huge biker guy with a beard and shouted, Hagrid, you're real! Oh shit, what'd he do? Hugged you. Aw. Still a better love story than Fifty Shades of Grey. Dude, are you ready to party? Um, who's this? Oh, sorry, wrong number. Bye. But I want to party. But anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Comment below. Let me know what you are doing on New Year's Eve. Have you guys ever drunk texted somebody? Or had somebody drunk text you? I want to know.
make sure you hit that like button, the face, and subscribe to the Wolf Pack. Oh, I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.